Hey guys, this is Adrian in from Odeo, and we're going to go over what's new in version 1.2 of Easy Arrows. So by popular demand, we have included a feature that locks the endpoint of your stroke. So if you go into the arrowhead layer, under effect controls, you'll see there's an Easy Arrow enable end. And if you check that box, it's going to lock the endpoint of the stroke in place. So even as the head moves forward, it won't follow like it typically does. And then the effect below it called Easy Arrow End allows you to manually control that endpoint. So if you have it going off frame or for whatever reason you just want to have that point locked, now you can do so. With it unchecked, it will still follow like so. Now we've also fixed an issue with taking 90 degree turns where the arrow was separating from the stroke. So that is fixed as you can see. And we've also added the ability to update your arrow with a default tail even after the script has been run. So with your shape layer selected, check the box create default tail and click update arrow. Pretty cool. Now we also saw somebody using the Easy Arrow script to pull off a hand and arm maneuver that I wanted to show you just because I thought it was really cool. So we just have a simple shape layer path arced into the frame here. Now I'm going to select that and hold command and select the hand layer and click create easy arrow. And this will do what you expect. It attaches that image to the head of the stroke attached to the anchor point of that object. And you can still control the rotation the size of this. And you can see we can make it look like an arm coming off of that hand and we can enable the end point of the stroke. So it's locked off frame. And now we can keyframe this animation to make it look like we have an arm coming in and pointing into frame. I'm going to go ahead and do that to the other arm as well. And I just thought that was a really cool look and I uh, just wanted to show you guys it was possible. And I'm sure there's a lots of other cool things you can pull off with the script. And I'm excited to see more and excited to share your work. So feel free to send that in to me. Well guys, that's what's new in version 1.2 of Easy Arrows. If you're unfamiliar with the script, be sure to watch the overview video on our website to get a better idea of what it can do. Thanks for watching and I hope to see you again next time.